welcome back to my channel. If you don't know who I am, I'm Jenna and I live in South Korea with my husband. So today and the next few weeks, my husband and I are officially PCSing from South Korea to Germany and I wanted to take you guys along with us and see how it is from Oconus to Oconus and what all goes into a PCS. I've been prepping for the last few weeks of this. I've bought some storage bins and I have taken some stuff off the walls. I have packed as much as I can and I'm just trying to prep as much as I can before the movers get here so that it's a little bit easier on them and I have peace of mind that I have packed the things I need to pack and I just wanted to take you guys along with us and show you how it really is because honestly PCS season is honestly the hardest thing I've ever had to do. Thankfully this time I am having help with Garrett and you know, I'm not doing it all on my own, but it is still a very stressful time in any military person's career or life. And I just wanna be real with you guys. Now, and to make things even more stressful, we don't have just one dog, we have three. So we have to do three of everything for the dogs and it's very expensive. The military does not pay for your animals because animals are optional. Um, I'm not going to get into that because it hits a really tough, sore su subject in my own personal life and that's okay, but yeah, it's a lot with three dogs, two humans, a whole house to pack up and yeah, so let's do it. First off, there is a lot of paperwork. So with the dogs, a ton of paperwork for each dog, a ton of different things that they have to do and a ton of different requirements they need to leave Korea and to enter Germany. And thankfully, we started a long time ago on the dogs, so it's not a huge deal anymore. We only have like two more things to do and the dogs are all good. And then obviously you have to schedule movers. You have to schedule a, an appointment for your car to be shipped out if you have a car. You have to schedule PCS clean out. You have to schedule a, a uh, I don't even know what the word is, like a check of the house. So like, a, I don't even know. But anyways, you have to have someone, the realtor come and look at the house and make sure it's all good to clear out and then you stay in a hotel and I'm not looking forward to that because this is my sanctuary and I will let you know how it looks because it looks terrible and I'm going to be embarrassed to show the whole world this but that's just part of a PCS. Here is our UAB so this will be shipped out and it'll probably get there right when we get there. So Garrett has all of his army gear, I have my incense and I even have my own little military bag Garrett let me have. So I put my yoga mat and some clothes and my hair cutting supplies so I can cut Garrett's hair when we get there. And then I got these totes for our more nicer items that we don't want to get ruined. And then here is our monstrosity of a office waiting to be taken. Now, if we're close or you know me pretty well, you know I'm a pretty big planner when it comes to big things like this. So highly invest in one of these trifold things and put all of your information, label them. I have my health one. I have just miscellaneous uh, certificates, etc. I have each file for a dog and then I have a file for the travel, the PCS and the prior orders and then also the new orders. So make sure you invest in one of these, maybe even one that's even bigger, but you know how it goes if you are in that military life. Number two, get yourself a calendar. I never had a calendar until I begged my grandma to make me a calendar because she makes calendars for everyone. And they're just so cute and they're personalized and adorable. Anyways, so this is my month of June. It is crazy. So we have movers coming this Thursday. We have movers coming this Friday. And then we will have an empty house for another few weeks. And then we will go to a hotel. So it's just a lot. And then, you know, make sure you write your appointments. Third, if you are PCSing with dogs, start as soon as possible, if not even sooner. Make a file and put the, all the information that you're going to need all the time in a cute little separator thing for each dog. So since I have three dogs, I have three little files. And you know, the older that they get and the longer you have them, the bigger they grow. So just make sure you keep them all organized and keep all of the necessary paperwork you will need. And third, these are a lifesaver and I will go into more depth, but please get them. You can get them on Amazon and I'll show you how it works in just a second. 
And before I move on, I want to get a little shout out to First Class Pets and her name is Gina and she is on Camp Humphreys and she helps with PCSing, with shipping and she's overall just a great person and I'm so thankful that we now have this awesome outlet to have and to not have to worry as much. She is a pet shipper and she also helps families PCS with dogs as cargo and extra baggage and she charges $350 per family and mind you I'm sure this will change the busier and the more popular she gets so just make sure that you contact her and make sure that you are getting all the right information from her anyways for right now July 2020 or 2021 sorry she is charging $350 per family so this is a company pet service and with that $350, you can have as many pets as you want. We have three, so it's not $350 per pet, it is $350 per family. So we could have 10 dogs and it would only be $350. Just kidding, probably more. Um, so this is what it includes. It includes pickup from the residence in Humphreys, animal quarantine inspection at the port. So she will take the dogs to the port and make sure that they get their stamp to leave Korea. Comes with excuse me, the labels for the crates, water bottle dispenser for the crates, bowls for the crates, zip ties for the crates, and three nights of boarding. And if you want more, you have to pay a little bit extra, but we are taking full opportunity of that because distance makes the heart grow fonder, even with your fur babies. And she will deliver the pets to the airport and she will assist you at the check-in counter. And I think that is well worth $350. I would even pay more just because it's so convenient and she's a really nice person. She takes care of your dogs and she has a great boarding facility. So if you are PCSing, please get in contact with Gina. She actually has an office on post. I forgot what building number she is, but you can look her up on Facebook. And back to the tote scan. So I have boxes that I have already kind of pre-packed. So what you do is you download the tote scan app, you put a label onto the box you want, and then you go ahead and name the said box of what you want it to be. You then take a picture of what is inside the box and then you save the box. So it makes it really convenient for you to find things that you don't know where it is and you don't wanna go through all of your boxes. As you can see here, I have a whole bunch of home decor and I'm crazy about home decor. So I have labeled these boxes and I will just go in there and be like, oh, picture frames and then just random stuff. And I've already put them on other boxes to know what is what. And yeah, so it'll make my life a little bit easier. And I'm just looking forward to having an easy PCS. But is there really anything about an easy PCS? Let me know. Okay, so on to a really sad part for me. I have loved my fridge ever since I started putting our photos from our travels together and putting them on there and it's just really sad to take them down but I knew it was gonna have to happen one day and I just wanted to show you guys before they all come off. I've already taken some off but here are some of our adventures from all of our travels and I'm just really thankful that we were able to do all of the things that we did even amongst a pandemic. It's so surreal taking everything off of these because these are all of our adventures here in Korea and Korea will always hold a special place in my heart because this is the first time that me and Garrett lived together and Korea, we just love it. And then here we are. They took four hours just about to pack up the stuff and they did a really good job. They were very thorough. I never once felt like they were gonna break anything. And now here it is in all its glory. Everything's packed up, ready to be taken downstairs and it looks a lot smaller than it does when everything is out in its place. And it's just so surreal and it's so sad because we love this apartment and it's just sad. So the thing about this shipment, it is going back from, from Korea to the States and then from the States to Germany. So it's gonna take four months. We won't get our stuff until October and it's July right now. So see you later stuff. See you in October, see you in Germany. Oh, there you go. Well, we build these holes quicker. This one's way higher than the other one, so. Shh. 
and here is our car inspection. We did a good job cleaning it and it is ready to go and we will see you in Germany. Bye Mazda, see ya!